school has kicked off again, and with so many people moving around, it may be easy for your pet to get lost. Our sunny side tells us why it's important to get them microchipped sooner rather than later. Pets can disappear within a matter of seconds. Microchipping them may increase the possibility of you reuniting with them. We adopted Honey from PetSmart in December. Whenever we got her, the microchip was already placed in her. And when she got lost in March, that is how we found her. Amanda was on her way to work when her cat Honey ran out the door and didn't come back. I just kind of sat around just to see if anybody would call me and nobody did. And so after about probably a month or so, I figured um, either somebody had kept her or um, something had happened to her and she wasn't going to get to come back home. A whole three months later, Amanda received a shocking call from Aggieland Humane Society asking if she was missing her cat. When I got that call, it was very, I was surprised, of course, but I was so excited, I couldn't believe it. Someone had found Honey and wanted to keep it. When they brought Honey to the shelter to get it fixed, the team at Aggieland Humane Society recognized that Honey already had been microchipped. A microchip is a, is a tiny device that is inserted between your pet's shoulder blades. Um, and here at the shelter, it costs $25. What happens is we put that chip into your pet, we register your contact information, nationally. This information is shared with vet offices, animal shelters, and pet stores who can scan your pet if it is lost. We see over 3,000 pets annually. Um, I would say roughly a third of those have a chip and even less of those are we able to actually find proper contact information where sometimes the chips aren't registered with the right information. She adds, the shelter sees an increase in lost pets during the fall and winter season, so it's important to get your pet microchip now. In College Station, Sunnyside, KAGS News.